Peaches, so welcome to Preview, where friends don't let friends watch movies alone. I'm Adam. And I'm Jay. And today we're going to react, review, Earth. and at the end we're going to rate the, one of the biggest blockbusters of last year. One of the biggest blockbusters of the decade. Yeah, actually, one of the biggest yeah. blockbusters from the Animaniac ever made. Yeah, crazy. Barbie! Barbie, baby! This one's a little bit of a throwback reaction, you guys. Uh, for those of you who may not know, over on our Patreon every month, we do a movie watch-along for the Illuminati tier. Mm -hmm. It's the top tier of our Patreon. It's the best of the best, the brightest of the bright, the sloppiest of the goblins. That part's true. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we started doing movie reactions on the channel, and you guys have received them very well so thank you guys for watching those uh -huh. and enjoying those we mm -hmm. really appreciate it uh but we recorded a lot of movie watch alongs for patreon before we really knew how to translate that content onto youtube in a way that wouldn't get us copyright striked or into the, the ground or, or the channel take it away from us <laughs> so now that we figured it out we want to take some of those uh patreon exclusive watch alongs and give them the full youtube edit treatment mm -hmm. and this is the first one we're doing uh and if you want to consider joining our patreon uh the the watch along tier uh is our seven dollar tier that's going to get all of the movies all of the shows as well but the illuminati tier something is changing mm -hmm. uh, the illuminati tier is going to have exclusive access to our movie watch alongs right as they get recorded uh the movies do take about a week or so to get fully edited and so you will have at least a week's least. head start mm -hmm. on all of our movie watch alongs uh, and those have been doing quite well so yes, they have. check it out or don't it's a lot coming i'm not your mom oh that's right he's not your mom <laughs> <laughs> enjoy the reaction we love you we'll see you guys soon dude if they did a hot wheels like fast and series type the first movie little girl ever existed there have been dolls but the dolls were always and forever Baby dolls. This continued until. Oh, look at that little cutie with the glasses. <laughs> it's spooky. She really does look like her. It's very upsetting. I wonder what the direction was for that young actress. Because <laughs> she nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> The fun thing about this, this is almost a shot for shot remake of, of yeah, 2001. Yeah. But like it's the same sequence mm -hmm. just with different props. <laughs> Hi Barbie. Barbie changed everything. All of these women are Barbie, and Barbie is all of these women. She has her own money, her own house, her own car, her own career. And this has been reflected back onto the little girls of today in the real world. Thanks to Barbie, all problems of feminism and equal rights have been solved. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay. And that's where we're starting from. <laughs> okay, good. When I wake up in my own pink world. It's so, f it's like... You know, when you think about the concept of movie stars, mm -hmm. it's like, it always seems like, oh, like, you know, there's so much about show business, about luck and everything, but then there's just like people like Margot Robbie, where it's just like, oh, she's the prettiest person you've ever seen, and she's an incredible actress. I'm sure she smells amazing. Like, it's the kind of thing where it's just like, she's just built different. <laughs> like, it's the kind of thing where it's like, oh, it's about luck and yada yada and training and talent. And, and some people are just like... Here I am. <laughs> like, I I'm perfect in every way. If that was really a mirror, you see a perfect smile. Did your sister have Barbies? Yes, but not many. My sister had Barbies. I remember she had this pool, too. We would play with it all the time. It was super fun. <laughs> yeah, because it was like, like you would fill it with water and like there was a water slide. It was fun. It was oh, a fun wow. Toy. I'm pretty sure that uh, whipped cream was uh, digital, so that was actually a pretty tough yeah. shot. You use your imagination. Hey, I was still singing. <laughs> Hi, Skipper. Barbie. And Mitch. Mitch was Barbie's Oh, yeah. Friend. The director of Saltburn, everybody. Reporter Barbie, you can ask me any question you want. How come you're so amazing? No comment. Oh! 
Black Bob is president. Black Bob. So seriously, no in our assessment, money is not speech, and corporations have no free speech rights to begin with. It's just their attempt to turn our democracy into a plutocracy. <laughs> yeah, Barbie! Get up, Barbie! I have no difficulty holding both logic and feeling at the same time, and it does not diminish my powers. That's right. It expands them. I think I'm starting to understand why some people had a real problem with this movie, Jay. <laughs> it can be a little heavy-handed at times, but it's on purpose. Yeah, yes. <laughs> No, I think uh, this movie just didn't nail every, every little thing to me, but but where it, it really nails it where it counts. Yeah, it's like the new Wonka movie. It didn't really nail it, but where it counts it. Oh, I... Clever with the background, I see that. Mm -hmm. But Ken only has a great day if Barbie looks at him. Hi, Ken. Hi, Barbie. Yeah. Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. I got us both. Oh, hey. Barbie. Hi, 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 Barbie. It was very sweet um, when we were, when, during bonus action, mm -hmm. when all of us were doing hi, like, Barbie, but, like, with the apostrophe B. Oh, yeah. And your mom was, like, saying hi to everyone. It was very, very sweet. I was like, oh, it's a, it's a, the Barbie movie. Barbara, <laughs> that. You're the you're the you're you're the best of us. <laughs> oh, hey, Barbie. Hi. Hey, Barbie. <laughs> oh, looks like this beach was a little too much beach for you, Ken. I would beat you off right now, Ken. I'll beat you off with you any day, Ken. Let's beach off. Wait, who are wants they to saying beach him off? Has beach to beach off. off okay, first. but they are saying it the way that you are. You are. I'm supposed. I'm supposed to be here. And get the way I am. Okay, good. Because <laughs> that's the way those toys <laughs> operated. Yeah. <laughs> Great. Not even broken. You'll be fine. You're very brave, Ken. Thank you, Barbie. Yeah. Hey, Barbie. Yeah. Can I come to your house tonight? Sure. I don't have anything big planned, just a giant blowout party with all the Barbies and plant choreography and a bespoke song. You should stop by. I love this script already. <laughs> I love this. I love it. <laughs> Margaret Robbie is the type of talent and the type of personality that, that people burned Troy over. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> sure. They're like, well, they they went to, to, to war over one woman, and I was like, you didn't know what Helen looks like. <laughs> I mean, if she Helen was, any, was anything like Margot Robbie, Robbie, Robbie yeah, 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 I understand. I'm gonna be honest with you, Adam. I feel like I feel like we should just get you one of those white jumpsuits, <laughs> so I could be a Ken <laughs> for like Halloween. That would be a great Halloween costume for you. In the gold cups. Yeah. That's a love is blind reference tonight. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a me face one trying to dance. I think you're a fine dancer. You seem to get out of your own head. What's Why? That? How? What? Why would I ever get out of my own head? It's so, it's so funny Everything's to me. Fine. It's so Everything's fine. It's so funny to me here. how you can be like so... There will be times where you can just be thinking about nothing. And you can just kind of turn turn it off. But then, like, when it comes to, like, being on the dance floor, you're like, I'm so self-conscious. So I was like, this is the one time where I can turn my brain completely off. Fascinating to me. Wait, you can't do a flip like that, Ken. <laughs> what? <laughs> that guy, man, Shang-Chi is so handsome. He's He's got a good head of hair, too. Yeah, he, yeah. <sighs> Even Wednesdays. <laughs> Dying. I don't know why I just. I'm just dying to dance. <laughs> well, no that that wasn't the that wasn't the trailer. Yeah, but I no that was more of the the acting there <laughs> of the oh no uh oh I I broke the facade. Yeah. Uh. I thought I might stay over tonight. Why? Because we're girlfriend boyfriend. To do what? I'm actually not sure. This is my dream house. It's Barbie's dream house. It's not Ken's dream house, right? 
<laughs> right as always. And it's girls' night. Come on, Barbie. No. Summer party. <laughs> Hurry up. The president's here. I am. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I arrive at Adam's house every day to shoot. When I wake up, hey Bobby, hey, why Hi, so Barbie. stressed? Could it be those irrepressible Hi, thoughts of death? <sighs> P, panic, I, I'm scared. <laughs> N, nauseous, K, death. <laughs> okay. it, really, it really set like it world builds so efficiently and so quickly and so fun and then oh, oh, girl, it's just okay? so efficient hi barbie i'm hi, barbie. good i'm good hi barbies i nailed it hey. like i don't know what's going on it, like clearly because i haven't seen the movie but this almost seems like a inside out situation of like a <gasps> oh I feel like a girl just playing with her dolls or whatever and starting to like, I'm like a teenager now and I'm starting to have thoughts and yes. like, uh, oh, Barbie. Mm -hmm. I don't even have context for this, but my feet, my heels are on the ground. That's okay. Let me see. <gasps> Flat feet! <laughs> yeah. Stop it, Ken. I'm sorry. I know I'm stereotypical Barbie and therefore don't form conjectures concerning the causality of adjacent unfolding events, but some things have been happening that might be related. You're malfunctioning. What? No, I'm just, I'm... You know, you're gonna have to visit Weird Barbie. Someone played with her too hard in the real world. Come to the world! Yeah. Hello? Whoa. <laughs> Hey, what's cooking good looking? Hi. Welcome. Huh. Hi, how are you? Nice to meet you. Sorry about the dog crap. I just had to come see you about my feet. You're stereotypical Barbie, right? Mm-hmm. That Ken of yours. He is one nice looking little protein pot. I'd like to see what kind of nude blob he's packing under those jeans. <sighs> Our nude blob. <laughs> You've opened a portal. I didn't open a portal. And now there is a rip in the continuum that is the membrane between Barbie land and the real world. And if you want to be stereotypical Barbie perfect again, then baby girl, you got to go fix it. Look at your upper thigh. What is that? That's cellulite. That's going to spread what? everywhere. And then you're going to start getting sad and mushy and complicated. No! <laughs> what do I have to do? I'm sad and mushy and complicated. And I'm Ken. <laughs> And the girl who's playing with you, she must be sad. And her thoughts and feelings and humanness are interfering with your yeah, dolls. You know Why would she be sad? I'm so smart. All right, this movie is just really good at communicating itself. So should it? Oh. So <laughs> what'll it be then? You can go back to your regular life or you can know the truth about the universe. The first one, the high heel. No. So there is no option one? No, you have to fix the rip yourself. Don't blame me. Blame Mattel. They make the rules. Send me through the portal. Okay, there's actually no portal. It's not oh. a figure of speech. It's actually a sports car. Which will take you most of the way to the state of Los Angeles, where you will don neon and rollerblades and enter the country of California. Thank you. Come on, be careful. I love you. Hi. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna miss you guys so much. Oh. I just wish someone could come with me, but you can't. Yeah. I should do this alone. You'll get to see all the good work we've done to fix the world. You'll be such a hero to them. All those grateful, powerful women they owe their wonderful think... lives to Barbie. Oh my God! Yeah, they're oh. living in the delusion that that Barbie fixed it. I just thought that was just meta commentary at the beginning. Oh, no. they actually. Yes. Oh my God! Bye, oh, the mermaid! Hi, <laughs> mermaid Barbie. Yeah. <laughs> what? I drink from fountain coaster. I am defined. Yeah. Closer, I am defined. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> holy! <laughs> I made a double bet with Ken, 
And you can't make me look uncool in front of Ken. Ken's not cool! He is to me. You're just gonna slow me down. He is to me. What if there's beach? <laughs> what if there is beach? California is beach. It's a lot of beach. Yeah, I mean, it wait. makes a compelling argument. I literally go nowhere without them. <laughs> they live in skate space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's really charming. It's the art direction. They they just super nailed it. <laughs> My sister absolutely had these outfits for both Barbie and Ken. I feel kind of ill at ease, like conscious, but it's myself that I'm conscious of. I'm not getting any of that. I feel what can only be described as admired. And there's no undertone of violence. Mine very much has an undertone of violence. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mine wow. very much has what, an undertone. What a fucking scene! That's amazing! Yeah. Baby, you are I can see myself in your shorts. I don't know exactly what you meant with all of those little quips, but I'm picking up on some sort of entendre, which appears to be double. And I would just like to inform you, we don't have genitals. That's okay. Yeah, yeah whatever. Yeah. It's, it's cool. yeah. I have all, all the genitals. Everything's almost like reversed here. Oh, look! <laughs> so <laughs> They're so smart. Yeah. Yeah, bro! Do it, bro! I think we should get some different clothes. You look great. I love fringe. <laughs> this is a the fact that they were able to craft these scenes with these really large concepts and like nail it in like ninety seconds. Well, you seconds. know why? Because the, the 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 comedic mechanism is just being is just saying the thing. Mm -hmm. So it's just cutting through the treacle. Like this movie could fall into the of being coy mm -hmm. so quickly that they just were like, no, we have no time for coy. What's up, man? We got a man up on this great workout. Do you, do, you, do you think I could pull off a fur like that? Yes. I think I could too. Would that make me a douche? I. You, it depends on the type of coat. I feel like I'd wear it with such a joke. I feel like I'd wear it like the ghost of Christmas present. You know, I feel like I'd... Well, then be you're going to be a little bit of a douche. I think... Oh, I there'd, think, be a, there'd be a light jaunt to it. Okay, it, I mean, it depends on the cut. And the fringe, and the I'm not saying I, that that will be the cut of the Ghost of Christmas Present. I'm saying I would wear it with the jaw, like the jovial nature of the Ghost of Christmas Present. Uh, is your mom going to be dying? Oh, no. No, no. You're good. None of that. I don't know. You're so beautiful. I know it. <laughs> for me! For me! Yes! I, I got, got it. it! Oh, what do you got? You go first. Man She's at the world! <laughs> what was that? The kids at the school? But what did you say? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm enjoying this a lot more the second time, I have to say. You know, when we react to stuff, I watch things way more intently yeah. than I ever do anything else. Yes? Oh, hey. Hey. Oh, hi, Aaron. New drawings? Please don't. Yeah. She gives a monologue that might get her a Best Supporting Actress uh, Oscar. Aaron, they're in a big corporate idea session. No one is to be Always admitted. Be Aaron. empowering Aaron. girls. Always. But what do we really see? I'm kind of surprised Mattel would allow themselves to 
You'll see. They actually, it's, um, it's not in bad taste. Oh, okay. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> A man and a horse. I've started to get all these weirdo feelings. Like I have fear with no specific object. What is that? It's anxiety. I have it too. They're just awful at this age. I feel amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to pop into the library and see if I can find any books on trucks. Okay, just don't get in trouble. I won't. <laughs> I won't. That's Sasha. You can never talk to Sasha. Don't worry. Everyone really likes me and thinks I'm cool and pretty. Hey, ladies. Sasha. What's up? I also think... Who are you? Um, we could get you a, a gender-bent uh, cosplay of that, and that would be really Barbie. fun. Barbie! <laughs> and I'll be Alan. Aren't you guys gonna... Thank me and give me a big hug. <laughs> we haven't played with Barbie since we were like five years old. Even then, it was horrible for us. It was horrible? Come on, Sasha. Give it to her. Destroy Barbie. You've been making women feel bad about themselves since you were invented. You represent everything wrong with our culture. Sexualized capitalism, unrealistic physical ideas. No, no, no. You set the feminist movement back 50 years. You destroy girls' innate sense of worth, and you are killing the planet with your glorification of rampant consumerism. And until you showed up here and declared yourself Barbie, I hadn't thought about you in years, you fascist. Does Barbie know what that is? <laughs> Men wars, horses. Why didn't Barbie tell me about patriarchy? Which, to my understanding, is where men and horses run everything? Sure. I shall seek my fortune there. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take a high level, high paying job with influence, please. Okay, you'll need at least an MBA. Isn't being a man enough? Actually, right now, it's kind of the opposite. You guys are clearly not doing patriarchy very well. No, <laughs> no, we're, uh,. <laughs> We're doing it well. <laughs> uh, hide it better now. Oh. No, I won't let you do just one appendectomy. <laughs> but I'm a man. But not a doctor. Please. No. Please. <laughs> but I'm a man. And I need a clicky pen. No. And a white coat. No. And a sharp thing. No. There He's he so is. good in this Somebody movie. The two of them are I'd like just... to apply for your job of beach. So... <laughs> yeah, I'm here for beach. Yeah. <laughs> she thinks I'm a fashion. I don't control the railways or the flow of commerce. Oh, she does. <laughs> Miss Barbie? Who are you? We're Mattel. Mattel? It's Mattel. Yeah. I know. I'll go back to Barbie land and I'll tell the Kens what I've learned. Oh, it's going to be beautiful. <laughs> okay. Back to Barbie oh, let's land. Let's go, uh -oh. go that way. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Thanks for the ride. This has been so much fun. <gasps> wow. The mothership. Hey, you really think about it? The Mattel logo is like the most basic logo. Barbie, <laughs> so happy to see you. Would you like some mineral water? Yes, thank you. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not used to that having anything in it. <laughs> <laughs> so we've been very anxious to get some quality FaceTime. Why is he sitting? If you're agreeable to it, we would love it. If you could just get into that giant box. Get into the box and you'll go back to Barbie land and everything will be as it was. You know what, we should probably get Ken first. Ken isn't something we're worried about ever. He doesn't sell. He doesn't sell. Could I just meet the woman in charge, your CEO? Oh, that would be me. Oh, your CFO. Me? Your COO. Here. President of the Barbie division. President. I'm a man with no power. Does that make me a woman? We had a woman CEO in the 90s. And there was another one at some other time. Every single one of these men love women. I'm the son of a mother. I'm the mother of a son. 
I'm, I'm the nephew of a woman aunt. Some of my best friends are Jewish. <laughs> hmm. Gosh, I remember this smell. I'm having real Proustian flashback. Oh, very nice. Oh, you know what? Um, before I get in the box, could I just run to the restroom and make sure my hair is perfect? Get that for me! It's a Robin sample. You do love Robin. She's the slash to the Spice Girls Ninja Turtles. I love her. Hi, Barbie. Uh, she's entered luminal space. Liminal? Yeah, man. Liminal? The, the back liminal? rooms. Yeah. Is the Mattel building just full of different pocket dimensions? Yeah, dude. I think that's how you make the other Mattel movies work. You just maintain that Mattel is this like weird, interesting place. Uh -huh. And then just tell all the stories around it. That makes sense. Don't worry. You're safe here. What is this place? <laughs> I always find, I think, hey! the kitchen tables. <laughs> Careful, there's actual liquid in that. You look different. Oh, well, that's not how I normally look. I usually look perfect. I think you're just right. Real world isn't what I thought it was. It never is. And isn't that marvelous? Are you? If you go through that closet, you'll mm. find a stairwell down to the lobby. Is she the who invented Barbie? Yeah. yeah. Thank you, um, Ruth. Ruth. Thank you, Ruth. You're welcome, Barbie. Sorry, you're trapped in the between realms, but... <laughs> yeah, apparently, we'll yeah, I, you, I have the ability to create things that, uh, you know, just occupy their own pocket dimension. That's weird, but... Somebody's got to go back and get a shitload of dimes. The stupidest, funniest yeah. choice yeah. to do to, <laughs> to fix the problem. <laughs> from school's house put a life-size barbie in our car i've been a little lonely lately and i found those barbies we used to play I with we gave those away i got sad and weird and then the drawings got sad and weird <gasps> i came, came for, for you, you. My kid's not gonna hate me. What? So my kid's not gonna hate me. She's not not gonna hate you he's at all at some you. point. Nope. He's gonna he's love you forever. You. He's gonna and respect you. I'm yep. the best. Yeah. Everyone will say, bird. I gotta lose these chuckleheads. Woo! <gasps> the Chevrolet Santa Fe. Where did you have to drive like this? There was this guy. His dad? Yeah, yeah, it was it was dad. Yep. <laughs> 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 it must be, I want to get into a car chase at least once in my life. You know? You tell you do not look at me like that wouldn't be fun. Yes, being chased is so much fun. Dude, but like get into get into, you know, to get to open it up and go vroom vroom, little car yeah, go fast. Vroom, vroom and like just get creative and get weird and do you know, get up to some hijinks. Are you really going to let Barbie take you and your tween daughter to an imaginary land? Yes, and you want to know why? Because I never get to do anything. Oh. What about Dad? You can't just leave him. He'll be fine. Boligrafos. 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 I've had the same problem. I'm saying the word, damn it, and I know I'm saying the word. <laughs> when I was a kid, I lost these boots, and my mom wouldn't let me buy a whole new Barbie just to replace the boots. They look so good on you. Why, thank you. Hey, you. She was always my favorite So, Barbie. how dystopian is Barbie Land now that Ken has uh, established uh, the fake patriarchy? It's totally fine. I'm sure, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's no big deal. Everything's totally fine and normal. It's not like Sora Mine has taken over the... Uh, yeah, man, no, it's cool. Hobbiton, right? Mm -hmm. Every, the Shire's fine, everything's fine. You like Urukai, right? <laughs> <laughs> I am 
<laughs> of her hats. I wish it was more fashionable. I'm just not. Hats? Just in general. You know, I think I have my own look. Yeah. But I don't, but I just, it's not, clothes are not something I really think about a lot. This is what I was supposed to do, bring you back here. It feels right. That's strange. I, I could imagine you would get really into beach volleyball, if given the opportunity. Maybe. I am pretty good at volleyball. Yeah, you'd like to, like a... I mean, I still have nerve endings in my forearms, so Hi, it digging hurts. Oh, crap! John Cena! Oh. Okay. Hi, Ken. Have a brewski beer. Everything's fine here. That's the capital. Ah! Horses. It's pink! <laughs> pink. That's... <laughs> The music changed. There's a guy singing now. Yep. yep. Everything, basically everything, exists to expand and elevate the presence of men. Oh, oh, it's beautiful. I know. <laughs> <laughs> what have you done? Don't question it. Just roll with it, tiny baby. Call me baby. This shall henceforth be known as Ken's Mojo Dojo Casa House. You don't have to say dojo and house. But you do because it feels good. Try it. Mojo Dojo It is fun to say. Mojo Dojo Casa House. There's certain things about this movie that kind of make me feel put on blast as a man. And I was like, and Kimberly was just like, you really want a Mojo Dojo Casa House? And I was like, yeah, I do. Yeah. I mean, we usually call them man caves, but we don't call them that anymore. And apparently they're selling like hot Yeah, man, you know why? Because Ken rules! But what does it matter if it's Barbie or Ken? The money is pouring in. You think I spent my entire life in boardrooms because of a bottom line? Oh, I got into this business because of little girls and their dreams in the least creepy way possible. <laughs> that's, and that's the difference. He actually gives a shit about Barbie. Oh. He's like, we're making money. Who cares? It's like, no, it's Barbie. It's always been about Barbie. As my bride wife or my long-term low commitment wow. distance girlfriend. Maybe I need to get my dad one of those. I don't do you though. A driver holster? A driver sheet? Yeah, he just kind of ruined it for everyone forever. I don't know. That's pretty badass. <laughs> Barbie, I'm so happy to see you. Can you believe what is happening? I know. Isn't it great? <laughs> Anyone need a brewski beer? What is wrong with them? We just explained to them the immaculate, impeccable, seamless garment of logic that is patriarchy, and they crumbled. Buckle up, babe. <laughs> because Barbie land, it's now Ken land. And it's going to be just like Century City in Los Angeles because they had it all figured out in Century City. No, no, no. They don't have it figured out in Century City because we failed them. No, you failed me. Out there, I was somebody. And when I walked down the street, people respected me just for who I am. Here, I'm just a dude. Let them know. Every day's back day, baby. In just 48 hours, all the Kens will head to the polls and vote to change the Constitution to a government for the Kens, of the Kens, and by the Kens! How's that feel? It is not fun, is it? It actually does... It, it, like, this movie really, like, really delves into the complicated uh, gen gender relationships. Yes. Because it's not because there's a lot coming from the Barbie side, but the Ken side was was also pretty astute in a way that I was not expecting. Yeah, every night is boys' night. Like we, <laughs> <laughs> it, that will honestly both directions. The two sunglasses will never not be funny. That's funny. Take your celebrate disco bell bottoms oh! and your ice capade pretty practice suit and dangling show skirt. Oh, these are archival. These are archival. <laughs> Get out! <laughs> Man, he is wrapped <laughs> for this movie. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! Yeah, dude's shredded. Guys, just up there making Parmesan cheese. Just, oof. No, I didn't wish anything. I've never wanted anything to change. That's life. It's all change. That's, that's terrifying. I'm just gonna sit here and wait and hope that one of the more leadership oriented Barbies just snaps out of it. Does something about this whole mess. So you're just gonna give up? Yes. Well done. Yep. Yep. 
That's hard. That's hard. Yep. Good job. Okay, kids. It's time to run out and get the new depression Barbie. She wears sweatpants all day and night. She spent seven hours today on Instagram looking at her estranged best friend's engagement photos while eating a family-sized bag of Starbursts. And she's going to watch the BBC's Pride and Prejudice for the seventh time until she falls asleep. The situation of our families is such that any alliance between us must be regarded as a highly reprehensible connection. Really is an incredible the uh, version of Pride and Prejudice. It's, he's, the, he's the best. Wake up. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the doctor. It's a bot, man. We interrupt this broadcast Close to bring you our new radio station. Back. Only play his favorite song. Yeah. Well, I will. Turn this song up for great shit. Who are you? I'm Alan. Oh, you are? That's great. <laughs> Don't tell the cans. I'm trying to escape. Having a Barbie in the real world is what caused all these problems in the first place. Not one person would care if Alan was in the real world. In fact, it's happened before. All of NSYNC, Alan. Yes, even him. So come on. Hey, you there. Who are you? I'm Alan. I'm, uh, I'm Ken's buddy. Yeah, all his clothes fit me. <laughs> Get him, Scott. You want a piece? No, wait, you don't have a driver's license. This car doesn't have an engine. Oh, fine. So, yeah, good point. <laughs> the kingdom. <laughs> we have to go back. Barbie Land needs saving. Oh, easy. Sleep. 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 It's fine. You're playing. Pl you made of plastic. <laughs> Everything's fine. <laughs> Let's go get my dolls. I'll never get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> this is your Nobel Prize. Remember winning it? Huh. It's useless trying to deprogram her. I already did everything I could. Oh my god. I'd like to thank. Ken. Blech. Thank you, Ken. I love you, Ken. <laughs> Off camera and back. Yep. <laughs> More discontinued Barbies. Growing up skipper? Her boobs grow. Why would they do that? Was that really a Barbie where... Yeah, no, the, every, everything is oh my God. absolutely That's, accurate. That is, why would you do that? I'm not pretty anymore. What? You're so pretty. I'm not stereotypical Barbie pretty. Note to the filmmakers, Margot Robbie is the wrong person to cast if you want to make this point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Margot Robbie is the type of person, is the type of woman that people have, like, countries have gone to war. I'm not good enough for any. It is literally impossible to be a woman. We have to always be extraordinary, but somehow we're always doing it wrong. Like you have to be thin, but not too thin. And you can never say you want to be thin. You have to say you want to be healthy, but also you have to be thin. You have to have money, but you can't ask for money because that's crass. You have to be a boss, but you can't be mean. You have to lead, but you can't squash other people's ideas. You're supposed to love being a mother, but don't talk about your kids all the damn time. You have to answer for men's bad behavior, which is insane, but if you point that out, you're accused of complaining. Never be rude, never show off, never be selfish, never fall down, never fail, never show fear. And it turns out, in fact, that not only are you doing everything wrong, but also everything is your fault. I'm just so tired of watching myself and every single other woman tie herself into knots so that people will like us. I did write a book. It's like I've been in a dream where I was somehow really invested in the Zack Snyder cut of Justice League. <laughs> We have to stop the Kens. And you need to say all of those things to the other Barbies. That's the key. How are we going to get the Barbies away from their Kens? We have experience with a world like this one. Do you have a map of Barbie land? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thanks. I built it. Little Barbie land. Yeah. You ever want, you ever want like a little map? Like a map, for, like a war room? That'd be, you ever think about that? Like a Spider-Man and his amazing friends type I, of thing? I like, think about Dresden with his little Chicago. I was like, that's a cool thing to have. I want, I want in like my my like work my, my mo the mojo dojo, dojo, dojo casa house. house. Yeah, I want like a I want a center table with like a map 
with all the different pieces on it, you know? Sure. Oh, Photoshop is so hard. I just don't understand how to use the select tool. Honey, let me show you. My tiny head is just swimming with technical jargon like color bands and magnetic lasso. Just listen. You have to be their mommies, but not remind them of their mommy. What happened? One minute I was president, and then the next I was cutting a Ken steak for him. Welcome back, Madam President. You can tell them that you've never seen The Godfather and that you love them. I've never seen The Godfather, and I don't care to watch it. I don't don't care. I don't care. I'm not really that worried. I don't care. Oh my God, you've never seen The Godfather? This movie is a rich blend of Coppola's aesthetic genius and a triumph to Robert Evans and the architecture of the 70s studios. Sure, cool, awesome. I don't care. I don't care. Sorry. (laughs) Neat. Or distract them with the old standby, wearing glasses so that they can discover that you're pretty. Yeah. Sure, go ahead. The little horse on the call. There. Now we can see your beautiful face. Hey, Jay. <laughs> yeah. So beautiful. Look at that. Look yeah. at that. Look at that handsome man. The difference is I've always known it. <laughs> Ugh, no. <laughs> You know, I was, you know what? I was thinking about doing that to you. You know, I was thinking about doing that to you. I, it would have been fine if you did, but you set it up in a way that I had, like... Oh, I, you had sorry, to. Dude, you had sorry, to. The, the mechanics rules of, of comedy, comedy I, I have to. I've been thinking. Mm-hmm. Kenland. Kenland. Really great. And the Kens really are just better at ruling than the Barbies ever were. Well, we just took patriarchy and, you know, made a patriarchy. Yeah. I'm ready to be your long-term distance, low commitment, casual girlfriend, if you'll still have me. Do you just hold on for one second? Oh, okay. Sublime! Here's the thing. Any guy watching this knows exactly what he was doing behind that wall. (laughs) Sublime! (laughs) Sublime! Come on in. I'll play the guitar at you. Oh, yay! Look <laughs> 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 at this song. That's all, guys. We're all just trying to be. We're all just want to be trying to be impressive and failing so spectacularly. And I don't know. <laughs> I obviously can't speak from experience because I don't play guitar. But uh, one of the memes on uh, TikTok for a while was mm-hmm. like how this is one of the more accurate. Uh, experiences of uh, this movie from a woman's perspective. I'm just a guy trying to yes, show off yeah, in his own. Yeah, in the, a lot of people being like, it was this exact song. It's hilarious to me how laser focused this is. texting huh? who are you texting no one hmm. let me just <laughs> Ken! sorry one sec it's a beautiful song that you're playing you want to sit here and watch me do it while i stare uncomfortably into your eyes for four and a half minutes i would love that so anyway here's wonderwall yep does the title of long-term distance casual low commitment girlfriend mean nothing what do we do we go to war doesn't seem to matter what I do. Do you think, well, did you like one of those, a horse blanket, if I got you a horse blanket? I don't like horses. I respect horses, but eh. I respect them. <laughs> you know, if we've learned anything from the, the, the arc of show business, it's that the Mickey Mouse Club really nailed it. They did. <laughs> like, I'll see you on the Malibu beach. Oh my god, the interior is bandana. Or no, it's horses. <laughs> oh, there we are. This is a real hornet's nest in here. Watch your flank. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh, just, yeah. Just bask in the glory. This is... He is the most proportional person. Who? Shang-Chi. I can't remember his name. It's more I can't remember how to pronounce his name. I don't want to mispronounce his name, yes. Yes. But, like, he is a a perfect specimen of a man. (laughs) Like, just from, like, proportions. Yeah. What will it take for her to see the man behind the tan and fight for me? I'm gonna be totally honest with you. My one of my big frustrations with this movie. Yeah. Um, I think there is a lot of uh, the Barbie side of the fence is extraordinarily mm. inclusive, and I don't think the Ken side is in a way that really bothers me. Inclusive, body shapes, body types. You know, I different see ty- what you're saying. And I know that maybe that's what they're going for with the Ken line, but I was just like, oh, I, I guess I'm not a Ken. That's a shame. But everyone can be a Barbie. But, huh? but do we want to be Kens? I'm not totally to sure. Today? I don't think we do want to be Kens. To change the Constitution? I don't know. It was today, wasn't it? <laughs> These Mojo Dojo Casa houses just get dreamier. That's because they're dream houses, mother. Whoa! <laughs> Don't look at me! <laughs> Alan. Sweet, sweet Alan. Can I sit up for a minute? <laughs> and those mini fridges are so small. Mm-hmm. You can only fit a six pack in them. They're perfect to go under a desk, Kimberly. Whoa! She's not watching. She's not watching this. Absolutely not. Ken. (laughs) I think I owe you an apology. Huh? I'm really sorry I took you for granted. Thank you for saying that. Oh, I didn't mean to suggest, uh... I just don't know who I am without you. You're Ken. But it's Barbie and Ken. I only exist... Within the warmth of your gaze. You have to figure out who you are without me. You're not your girlfriend. You're not your house. You're not your mink. Beach? Nope, you're not even beach. (laughs) Maybe all the things that you thought made you you aren't really you. Maybe it's Barbie and it's Ken. Ken is me. And I'm Barbie. Ken! <laughs> I want you to have it. Ken is right. It's just so hard to be a leader. It's. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Mitch. <laughs> Mitch. <laughs> Mitch. Do you know how many times I've wanted to stand up in a board meeting and, and just say, can we just tickle each other? Really? Let's have a company retreat. And just cut it off. Got shot, man. Yeah. And we can restore everything in Barbie Land to exactly the way it was. Mr. Mattel, I please just... call me mother. Wow. Oh, thank you. No, thank you. Oh. I have an idea. Tell me your secret dream, child. Okay. What about ordinary Barbie? She just has a flattering top, and she wants to get through the day feeling kind of good about herself. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. Yeah, that's going to make money. Oh, Ordinary Barbie, I love it. <laughs> that's going to make money. Oh, okay, great. <laughs> what does she get? What do you want? I don't know. The, I'm The right to choose what I want? I don't think I have an ending. That was always the point. I created you so you wouldn't have an ending. It's you. You escaped a little bit of space. <laughs> Liminal? Baby, I am Mattel, Ruth Handler, inventor of Barbie. What? <gasps> what? Come, walk with me. <laughs> Thank you, Barbie. Thank you. 
<laughs> I am Knuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh, those sweatshirts are selling like hat cakes. You understand that humans only have one ending. Ideas live forever. Humans, not so much. Being a human can be pretty uncomfortable. Humans make things up like patriarchy and Barbie <laughs> just to deal with how uncomfortable it is. I understand that. And then you die. <laughs> yeah. I want to do reimagining. I don't want to be the idea. Do you give me permission to become human? You don't need my permission. Don't you control me? I can't control you any more than I could control my own daughter, Barbara. And I always hoped for you, like I hoped for her. We mothers stand still so our daughters can look back to see how far they've come. Oh, crap. That's... I can't in good conscience let you take this leap without you knowing what it means. Brother certificate, you got on the grid, <sighs> paid the bills, you need a yeah. social security number, like all sorts of stuff. The DMV. The DM, yeah, DMV. So Barbie left behind the pastels and plastics of Barbie Land for the pastels and plastics of the Barbie Los movie that's extraordinarily evocative. God damn it, Greta Gerwig. Estoy muy orgulloso de ti. Orgulloso? Orgulloso. Orgulloso. It's really hard. It's really hard to learn a language when you're older. Yeah. Everything I said Hi. at the beginning, but it's like not totally clicking. I take it back. This is much better on the second watch. And what are you here for today, Barbara? I'm here to see my gynecologist. <laughs> uh, uh. Can, can I? This is probably, this is maybe wrong, but this is probably one of the best science fiction movies i've ever seen in my life oh i'm i wouldn't disagree what do you, how, what, what is because i don't know if that's the right genre of because but like this is science fiction how i is it not i, I that's, that's where my head that's it kind of felt like a science i would movie. say it's maybe science fantasy science like fantasy a, like sure. a science fiction fantasy mm -hmm. combo kind mm -hmm. of because it was it's much like if, if twilight zone is oh, okay is science fiction then how is this not Okay. But I but I see where you would where you would be hesitant to say that because yeah you know this, it's not really science no it's, it's just, just really like, yeah. it's just really competently made oh yes Greta Gerwig had a really really strong thesis yes and was able to use the vehicle of existential crisis Barbie and really like hey we need to have a conversation about gender stereotypes and yeah. society as a whole and like because we because we haven't really addressed this and somehow barbie is the perfect vehicle to yeah. discuss all of this stuff this movie existing the way that it does is a is such a huge sign of progress it's like not even funny because mm -hmm. like a mar a Barbie marketed movie in like if it came out in like ninety eight would have been a much different experience. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I really liked this so much more the second time. Yeah. I was only so so on it the first time. Really? But I yeah, I take it all back. That was that, that's it's uh it's sharp, but it's also fair. Mm-hmm. It's not it's uh it's not just uh It didn't blame anything. It just keeps pointing out like Hey, hey, these are all the issues that we have. Everyone's broken. Mm -hmm. We're all just doing the best we can. Mm -hmm. Wanted to kill that fat kid? Sorry. Chubby kid? Come on. 
But other than that, true enough. I'm just saying. You're, you're, you're you know wrong. what I'm saying. You are not wrong. I was like, I was like, they are really mm-hmm. making a choice on the Barbie side, mm-hmm. and the Ken side is not. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. doesn't. You're right. Yeah, you're right. But I also feel like such a like I feel like such a Ken saying that. You know, more like an Allen. I love this movie. Yeah, it was it's probably one of my favorite movies of the year. Oh yeah, this is great. Yes, like all the it's this is like. There's a reason this movie made so much money. Yeah. Because, like, it's endlessly marketable. It, like, it respects... It respects the product mm-hmm. that it has. It does, yeah. But it also doesn't... But it, it acknowledges the, the totality of it. Mm-hmm. There's no... There does not cut the edges off yeah, in no, any way. There's no actual villain. No. No, it's just... The, the villain... The villain is... Uh, uh, the lack of self discovery. Yeah, it's this movie. It's just a movie about self discovery. It's about people, for everybody. It's about everyone trying to figure out what they are, and what's going yeah. on with themselves, and realizing that it's really hard, and that we're all we all have issues. The only thing I will say is that I feel like it's a little harsh on the concept of a Mojo Dojo Casa house because those looked great. Those were those were awesome. Look at those big flat screen TVs. Yeah. Mini fridges. Come on now. Yeah, mini fridges. I just bags. think I should be able to have a Mojo Dojo Casa house without, you know, oppressing women. You know, I think they're not mutually exclusive. I think you, you can you know? separate the two. Yes. I think I think I we think can, can I think we can separate them. This is a fantastic movie. I lo- down with the patriarchy. Down with the patriarchy. Let's figure out some kind of mutual mutual uh, together arch- arch- yeah, together you know, arch- let's arch- all just a self improvement arch- Yeah. Let's all figure out that hey, we're all we're all doing the best we can. Let's give it. Let's give each other grace. Let's give each other the ability to thrive. Mm-hmm. Th- and and jive. Teamwork and friendship. Teamwork, friendship, thriving, jiving, doing well, and dancing at the same time. We're keeping all the dancing. Well, we kept it here long enough. Uh, <laughs> Thanks for being here, guys. Uh, this was fantastic. It's a fantastic movie. Uh, I look forward to watching it again, probably, you know, in a few, in, you know. This is a definitely, re- I will say, I rewatch it later on. The like details are everywhere. Second. Yeah, it's really it's good. Really good. Uh, great. All right. So uh, we have a lot of interesting, fun things coming your way this year. Uh, more news Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. More stuff on that. Thank God later. it's 2024. Get out of here, 2023. You Holy su- buckets. You sucked. Hey, 2024, please be better. It wasn't all that. We had a baby. You did have a you baby. You had a sweet baby. You had a sweet baby. Uh, okay, we will see you guys real soon. All right, we love you. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.